Yes, Brother Bilal. Okay, so I would like to have a general okay, question without going into okay, the specifics. So to have a general question without going into the specifics. Yes. So there is a certain confusion uh, regarding so uh, certain uh, free mixing, uh, uh, especially uh, in uh, certain okay. videos, for example. Especially in uh, certain yeah. videos, for example. Uh, like okay. podcast, for example. Uh, uh, like, is it uh, allowed for men and okay, women? Okay, what about for men and women in the same room speaking to one another allowed for men and women in the same room speaking to one another about marriage uh, for example where are you from brother so about you. marriage for example where are you from I am brother from france i am from france from france do you work in any in, in any job environment is there is there there's only one gender or there is generally two gender in in, in the work environment that you have uh, that might happen to be two genders. Uh, yes, but not always. Two genders. Yes. So yes. Let, let me not give always. you let me give you kind of um, a general ruling that free mixing. Generally, the scholars of Islam they said the free mixing is haram. Now, and they said it's haram based on certain things. Firstly, that it will uh, cause uh, people to be easy for them to to get uh, to to get to each other to the extent making making them. Failing into zina or iyadu billah, so it shouldn't be, it shouldn't be done the way that it is. Now, what you need to do, you need to limit it to the minimum. The li limiting to the minimum, for example, to have these limiting communication, etc. So even if you work on a job where there is mixed gender, but limit the, the communication with the opposite gender to the minimum. Just keep it in, in terms of your professions and whatever you are working, just to in the work environment, that's it. There is no joking, there is no extra things, etc. Now, and the same thing, it's for women as well, for sisters who are working in certain professional jobs as well. The same thing, they should observe the hijab properly, wear, you know, wear modest, and as well speak in a modest way. So some sisters, may Allah guide them in a way, you'll find them wearing modest clothes, but they will speak in, in, in modest way. Their, their, their language and their speech is not right. So they have to be both. The modesty is not just only what you wear, as well your speech, and this both for brothers and sisters. So this is how it should be. Now, if the if both genders they observe they they observe that they lower their gaze they have they have these communication to to limit it to just only to the to the need or the necessity. Alhamdulillah, that's fine. That's that's considered to be mixing. But when it comes to joking, when it comes to extra, when it comes to th things like that, then in that case, that's something which is uh, uh, it's not permissible in Islam. And, and generally, I'm not in favor, for example, for sisters, for example, generally to be on shows and things like this. I'm not in favor of this. Even some school allowed it uh, under certain limited circumstances, uh, which scholars, some scholars allowed it under these limited circumstances, but I'm not generally in favor of it because it could cause um, kind of, uh, you know, that uh, women generally, that, uh, you know, she will draw the attention to her, etc. And I'm not in favor of this, I myself. But again, but to say it's haram that just only a woman appears on the, on the thing, uh, uh, on, a, on, a, on a show or something, uh, uh, you know, I, I, I can't say it's hard, but I say it's best to do it, not to do that. And that's my take on this. Is that clear, my brother? Understood. So, so to be clear, um, we are in the context of where this may be allowed. Uh, it's in the case of uh, where the woman wears proper hijab, right? So in the case, uh, women do not wear proper hijab and uh, they appear on the show, would it be permissible for them to be there or be promoted? No, they shouldn't, they shouldn't be, if they don't wear proper hijab, if they put makeup and things like this, that's definitely not, even the scholars who allowed it, again, they didn't allow it the way that it is. And again, even some scholars, they said the woman, all of it is aura, all of her is aura, so she should abstain from being on, on the shows and things like this. And it's respected opinion of the scholars, which is, I, I'm an inclined to it, actually, as, as I myself, as well, and I do, and I do know that there are some scholars who allowed women for certain circumstances in order to educate other women, etc., or something like that, uh, then they allowed it as long as she doesn't wear uh, makeup, she doesn't, uh, you know, she wear in a modest way, and preferably to be uh, to be only women alone or, or things like that. That's my preference, again, with that. Is that clear, my brother? Very clear. Barakallahu Fiqh. Uh, have a great Hello, day, inshallah. Have a great day, inshallah. And you as well. Thank you, Barakafi.